yesterday. Um, so I wanted to share with you what I got in this one. I should have another one coming because I got, for last month, I got some stuff. But it takes a while to get here. So that's why I'm, this is the one I chose. And which box would this be? It's November. So this would probably be, I think, October's box. Because uh, I did have another box that I didn't show y'all guys. I uploaded it or tried to upload it, but it was really bad. I think that was September's. Yeah, I think that was September's box, and this is October's box. So I'm just going to share with you what I got. Um, darn it. I got this. I already ate it. <laughs> I got this Special K Chewy Nut Bar. It's the Cranberry Almond. And they're glue this is gluten-free, um, which I was really happy to see because it's hard to find um, granola bars that are gluten-free. Because um, they use rice flour and um, it has nuts in it. So if you are allergic to nuts, that's kind of the downside. But it was really good and it is 150 calories. So I, it's not, I mean that's kind of high in calories, but... Um, it was a really good bar. I actually might buy this. Um, I didn't buy it this time when I went to the store, but it's the Special K um, Chewy Nut Bars. I already ate it yesterday. I got the box yesterday. And then I also got, which I was excited about this, is I got the, uh, and I've already been using it actually, I used it today, the Clinically Strength Secret Invisible Solid uh, Deodorant. And um, I really like this. I've been wanting to try it, but I just haven't, haven't had a chance. Um, but this is the size we got, which is a decent size to try. And it smells really good. Sorry if you hear the wind. I have my windows open. And it's really windy outside. Um, it does have aluminum in it. That bothers me. But all deodorant has aluminum in it. Um, but that's the deodorant. So I got that. Then I got a little doggy treat. The Charlie Bear Crunch. So I'll give that to my dog. Um, it's a natural grain free dog treat. Bacon and blueberry flavored. So I got that. And then I also got a sample of the um, Nexacare uh, Band-Aids. It's one of the big ones. Oh, it has a coupon too. I didn't see that till now because I haven't opened it up. Um, it's one of the bigger Band-Aids. Um, waterproof uh, transparent dressings. So I like, I, I, it's always good to have, um, I think it's a dollar off coupon. Yeah. Which is good till next year, 2016. So that's awesome. And then this is what the... Oh, no, there's two. There's two band-aids. I'm sorry. Take that back. There's two. So that's cool. That's neat. It's always good to have some big band-aids all around. I always usually have the little ones. And then they also sent me a couple coupons. Um, is that it? Yeah, I think that was it. Um, the, of course, the $100, wine, $100 wine voucher, which I never use because... I don't drink that much wine. And then a coupon for the Secret or Gillette Clinic Clinically Strength. And this coupon is good till the end of this year. So that's good because I can, if I really like it, I can pick it up. And I also did, sorry guys, I just remembered. I did make a few purchases at the drugstore. I'm sorry guys, my hair is just, it's growing out. It's really in an awkward stage. I barely can put my hair back. I really, it's really driving me crazy. I'm sorry. Um, I bought a few things from the drugstore. I bought, and I've already opened them up. So, um, I bought the e.l.f. mascara and brow gel. I was out of that. I girls like that stuff like crazy. And then I also bought a Rimmel lipstick. I had a coupon for, um, and then it was in this bundle together with this, um, moisturizing renewal, renew, uh, universal transparent light. It's a lip liner and it's transparent. And I can't speak because I've been wanting to try that and it was a bundle together. And this one was very rose. And this is our new packaging. It's a little different than the old because I have said in some old packaging, but this is their new one. And this is in 260 Berry Rose. I actually gonna I think I'm gonna like this. It's kind of a frosty pink, um, but it's gonna be great for the fall. So I'm happy about that. And then I picked up an Alme um, single shadow. What do they call these? I picked up these before. This one's in Creme Brulee 125. And here, this is what it looks like. It's very sheer, so I'll probably use this in the crease or as a brow bone highlight. Yeah, it's really sheer. It's mostly, to me, I'm not too happy with this color, but it's like a very, I don't even know if you can see that. You could probably even use this as a highlight because it's so sheer and like, yeah, I could even use this as a highlight. Like, you can't even see that. I wonder if you could use it wet though. 
Yeah, it's really sheer. Not my favorite. I like the green one that I got a while back. And the purple one, the formulation on that one was just weird. And I think that's it, guys. Um... I am sorry about, I want to just talk about one thing really quick. I'm sorry about editing. I've been wanting to try to edit my videos and the software that I have on my computer is a pain in the butt. Like it's the Windows Movie Maker and that's the one I've been using for a long time so it's the one I'm used to. So I went to look for another uh, free, I need free because I can't afford right now to buy a software, uh, editing software. So I went to look for a new free editing software for my computer. Well, I found one, and I uploaded it, and it's even more confusing than the Windows Movie Maker. I'm a very simplistic person. I need something simple. I can't, I sat there for two hours trying to edit a, mo a video, and it was ridiculous. I could not figure it out. Um, and I don't mind spending time editing videos for y'all. I don't. That's not the problem. It's the problem that it shouldn't be that hard to figure out. Like, I'm not a computer expert, but honestly, it shouldn't be that hard. So that's why I have not been editing all my videos, because... It's hard for me. And if y'all have any recommendations for editing software for computers that are free and works well, please let me know. Because other than the Windows Movie Maker, what I'm having issues with that one is it works pretty good except for the fact that I have to reboot my computer after I've edited the video and saved it because it, the sound doesn't work. It, it, it does something to my sound on my computer. It starts messing it up. I have to turn my computer off, turn it back on, then listen to it, make sure it's correct. Then I can upload it. So... It has been a pain in the butt to try to edit my videos. I am sorry. I want to give you all the best quality I can. And I want them to be, you know, have good thumbnails. And I want it to be really good quality. But it's hard when your computer, like, it's crap and doesn't want to do what you want it to do. And when you try to edit it and you spend two hours, honestly, I, I don't mind spending two hours editing. It's just the fact that once you're done, you know, spent that much time, you should be done. And you shouldn't spend two hours trying to figure it out. Like... I'm just having frustrations and it's it's making me mad. So I'm sorry about that. Um, I'm gonna keep trying. And if like I said, if you have any suggestions, please put them down in the comments. I would really appreciate it. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.